Hey everybody, it's Matt from remove-malware.com. Saturday night. I'm going to go ahead and review uh, Webroot security. Uh, this includes Webroot uh, Spice Weeper, uh, their antivirus product, which is basically Sophos, and uh, I think they have some kind of uh, firewall product as well. I'm going to go ahead and start the install of it right now. I have a free trial. Um, if you haven't seen my videos, then you know I'm, if you haven't seen my videos, I'm dealing with a highly infected uh, test computer here. Uh, it's got over a thousand pieces of, uh, of uh, malware. Uh, that's viruses, spyware, adware, trojans, rootkits, everything. Um, the demo, the trial install of Webroot tries to install the Webroot Ask Bar. That's a bunch of bullshit. They need to get rid of it. Uh, that's a bunch of, sp uh, not even adware, but it, I guess it is sort of adware-ish. It, it installs an extra toolbar into your browser that is uh, pretty much a waste of your time. And they're just doing that to collect a commission. Simple as that. That right there kind of teased me off because uh, it's just, they're sort of uh, sort of dishonest in a way, trying to you know collect a commission on your uh, as you're trying to evaluate their product basically. Hold on one second, people. My wife is trying to talk to me about something. Hang on one sec. I'll be right back. It's asking me to restart, so I guess I have no choice. I'll go ahead and restart. Yeah, the computer's restarting. Um, just in an effort to save some time while it's restarting, I'll just pause it for a second. Uh, pause it. <laughs> I lost my cursor. Uh, pause it. Okay, back after that reboot. It was only a, a minute or so. Uh, Spice Weeper uh, has been installed. You can see the uh, the icon on the desktop there. Of course, it is not loading right away. Spice Weeper is a big old program. Nothing against it. If it does a great job, then it does a great job. But it is a big, big program. I've used this in corporations and on client PCs. I know. Um, most of my clients buy Spice Weeper. A lot of the people I visit have Spice Weeper on their computers. hear a little baby in the background. That's my daughter. I'm not adding sound effects or anything. Um, I don't have my, uh, I do not have my network card connected at this time. I'm basically just trying to get Webroot to come up. And we're just waiting. 
And uh, I hate to make people wait, but this is kind of how long it takes. If if you had an infected computer, a uh, really infected computer, and you went out to your local like Best Buy and bought Spy Sweeper with antivirus, and you installed it, and you wanted to clean your PC, this is about what you can expect. Right now, the PC is frozen. And we're just waiting. So uh, I'll go ahead and uh, pause it. Um, the clock is at 9.03. When I come back, I'll give you a time. Okay, honestly, this is the second time I've actually done this. And uh, it's locked up the PC again. So I'm going to go ahead and reboot. If it's still messed up when I reboot, I give up with Spy Sweeper. It's just, uh, I can't keep trying to make this work. So hang on, I'll see if it comes up. <laughs> uh, okay, I just rebooted the machine, and it's still locked up. Well... I don't have time for this. A lot of uh, people want to see uh, this review, but I've actually uh, tried to do this review uh, about six hours ago, and I had almost the same result. It just will not uh, let this machine boot any further. So I had I really wanted to see Spice Sweeper with antivirus, but. I suppose it's okay for machines that um, aren't infected, but I could not use this on a machine that's already infected. Uh, I just couldn't do it. Uh, if I was at a client's uh, location or house, business, whatever, I would be stuck with this result. This just isn't going to work for me. So sorry to cut it down to one video, but that's just the way it goes sometimes, guys. Um, talk to you later.